Good afternoon, dear children. Today we will see from textbook. Our textbook, that is unit number five, Out of This World. Out of This World. The name of the lesson it says, it, what it is saying? Out of This World. Not from This World, but Out of This World. What is there out of This World? Yes, out of this world is galaxy. You know, uh, we have seen uh, uh, pictures and all, jadu um, and all. That jadu means aliens, the people come from aliens, means out of the world, not from our world. We are, we belong this world. So here they have given very nice chapter, you know, those who are very interested in science and all, they like this, they will like this lesson very much, this unit. Again in this unit, two lessons and one poem is there. So out of this world, what is they have given in the out of this world? You see, uh, I think so few children might have seen that, but few children might have not seen but if you go to because i am saying as we are belong from maharashtra so if you go any any time to mumbai and all there nehru planetarium is there planetariums are there in all the metropolitan city if you get chance to go anywhere and if there is a nehru uh, planetarium means they tell the story the picture one hour two hour picture is there complete about uh, planets how many planets are there? there there were nine planets one is not there now drop that is now only today there are only uh, eight planets are there okay now that uh, you know how to remember uh, remind that uh, there is very my educated my very educated mother just say us nine planet so in that way my mars jupiter earth like this way we can keep in mind that uh, sequence there are eight planets are there Okay, so what is in that planet? If you go to that in Nehru Planetarium, very big theater is there. We get the chair and like this chair is there. If we see the top side, top side everywhere, they tell the story about planets. Very nice to see. Okay, and if you want any more information uh, in this, so you can surf Google also, net also and uh, there you will get much more information about this uh, new uh, world that is the galaxy, that is the planets. You know, we have the eight planets, uh, eight planet sun is a star that they have given. So let me read that page number 93 we will read. What is that the in introduction they have given? There are some interesting facts about the world out there. A world away from us. It's world away from us. We don't know where it is. We live on earth. We know about only earth. Like this how many. If you go in that I said not the planetarium they tell many galaxies are there very many many so uh, when i saw first time that i was really astonished sabhi hota hai but it's true yes it is there many scientists are there behind this they are searching but still we must get you know uh, we have not got that much information about this let us read some of them how many planets do you know of eight Yes, well, there are many more planets in the universe. Universe, world is different, universe is different. We know about only our planets, this nine planet, and some few people are there, they have reached up to moon. Moon, that only we are going to be learn the lesson. And from our India, also few people, two people are there, they also went there in the moon only up to moon not uh, any others okay any other planet well there are many more planets in universe eight being only in the solar system Even that eights are there in our solar system and only on this earth we have life 
means there is water air and uh, uh, sun and we need the human beings need and all mm, to survive all three things are very important that is available on earth only okay one solar system one year on venus that is the length of time it takes to finish one whole orbit around the sun is equal to 224.7 earth days see can imagine how much big it is Okay, second, around 1 million Earths can be fit inside the sun. Around the 1 million Earth, Earth we know how much big it is. Like this, 1 million Earths can fit inside the sun. Just imagine how much big the sun is world we cannot roam here are in a district place properly okay na so here the world means like this earth one million earths around not tentatively tentatively more than that also may be okay now can earth inside the sun the sun makes up 99.8 percent of the entire mass of the whole solar system you can cry in space but your tears won't fall down what it is there you can cry in the space but your tears won't come fall down on board the international space station water floats like a bubble water just a river flow hota hai that flows like a bubble bubbles you know chote 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 bubbles of spe or spears however the water will cling to a surface until it's uh, until it's uh, extricated this means that the tear starts from a uh, bubbles around your eyes as no wet environment is causing your tears fall understand means if you see the planets and know about uh, different different planet you will get the different different uh, amazing stories also about uh, that okay so here we will see uh, see dear children those who are really very interested in the milky ways the solar system and our universe many things are there you know one uh, thing even nobody could find out that that is we have heard many uh, that about the bermuda triangle I have seen the pictures, I read the books and all, but nobody could find out what is that Bermuda Triangle and if we go near to the Bermuda Triangle, it disappears. The how many aeroplanes, how many helicopters, they saw went there and but then nobody could find them. So see, so in this if you can see, so like this many many amazing stories are there about the universe that we don't know. We have seen that picture as I said Jado, which different aliens, aliens from different world and how they are, how they look, we also don't know. And for them also we, were, we are the aliens for them. I think so their, their world is also different. So if you are really interested go to google go to net and all you can surf all things okay now here we have seen the section number a that is the eagle has uh, eagle has landed eagle i think so they have given the name of that space you know the aeroplanes and the space astronauts what is pilot pilot flies aeroplane but the astronaut flies the space they drive the space and the space goes on the planet or somewhere topside not from one country to another country and this lesson has written uh, by Jack Higgins Jack Higgins about the author they have given her Harry Patter the eagle has landed Harry Patterson 1929 is a British writer his name is uh, Jack Higgins name is a uh, Harry pa Pattern also okay 
pseudonym Jack Higgins pseudonym means the pet name okay that is uh, Jack Higgins his name is uh, Harry Patterson he has written around 84 novels which have been translated into 55 languages okay this much information they have given about this author now we will see the uh, really is very interesting they have given the eagle has landed the eagle has landed on moon nowadays now science as science is progressing many people are going means few people they try so the first time they have given here but the who has reached the moon that is neil armstrong neil armstrong he has uh, uh, stepped into on the moon but from our India as we belong to our country our nation India so there the Rakesh Sharma first was the Rakesh Sharma was the first Indian person who kept step in the moon on the moon Rakesh Sharma in 1984 okay in 1984 after that Kalpana Chawla you know about Kalpana Chawla many children know about Kalpana Chawla Kalpana Chawla who flew twice in a space who flew twice not only once but twice in a space with NASA and died and died because the second time when she was coming back from there then in the explosion of a space shuttle Columbia at the end of a STS 107 the second mission Kalpana first was a Rakesh Sharma in 1984 and second time uh, Kalpana Chawla went and the not first time first time it was very successful second time she went there but while coming back here only few seconds were left to reach uh, on land down but something wrong it went wrong and that their space exploited and there with Kalpana Chawla few more scientists also died in the second mission this is second uh, personality from a India. So what we are seeing in this uh, second lesson, the eagle has landed. Eagle, they have given the name for that uh, spaceship. Did you know that a person would weigh much less on the moon? It is so because the moon has much weaker gravity than earth due to its smaller mass. So a human being would weigh about one sixth of his or her weight on earth. This is why the astronauts could hop and bound so high in the air. If you go to moon, moon there is no we have a gravitational force earth has much gravitational force it attracts towards us that's why if you are jumping from top to bottom within fraction you know if from 100 floors also if you are jumping within one second we reach down that much great gravitational force is there for uh, this earth but the moon doesn't have a gravitational force so there our weight is less suppose now my weight is 60 kg on the earth Earth. suppose my weight is 60 kg on earth if I go in earth my weight will be 1 sixth 1 six means my weight will be 10 kg on the moon if I jump you know jump like this high jump it will take few minutes to reach down because there is no gravity so many astronauts when they go there they hop they jump they enjoy there because no gravitational force okay the moon is about 1,60,000 kilometers away from earth space scientists created history when they landed on its surface read the passage we'll read this passage and we'll try to understand it was 16th July 1969 at a space entire in Houston in America at 9.32 in the morning the Apollo 11 spacecraft left Earth. You know we need one spacecraft. 
the scientists make that you know in our india chandrayaan 1 chandrayaan 2 like mangalyaan like this space the name of the space car so here 1916 16th of july 1969 Houston, America at, nine, at what time? 9.32 in the morning, the Apollo 11, the name of that uh, spacecraft, left Earth, left Earth to go to moon, okay, to reach the moon. Earlier, Apollo mission had practiced spending time in the space and adore orbiting the moon, orbiting, taking round on the moon. The crew members on this trip were Neil Armstrong. Crew, the team of scientists that is called the collective noun that is the crew. Okay, so the group of people mem members on this trip were Neil Armstrong, Michael Collins and Edwin Buzz Aldrin. Few were there in that uh, Neil Armstrong was there, Michael Collins were there, Edwin Buzz was there, and Aldrin. Like these people were there. Okay, after going around the earth one and a half times, the space took off for the moon. On 19th July, the Apollo began to orbit the moon. 16th July, they started, and 19th July, they reached nearby and it was taking round to the moon and I brought the command module what is meant by module module a self-contained component of a system a self-contained component if we are going you know somewhere some uh, their system computer systems are there that is called a module okay I brought the command module Columbia the crew settled in for their long ride to place where no human being had ever been before they were reaching the place jaha ki abhi tak koi bhi aadmi gaya tha aise jagah par wo log these people were going okay to where no human being had ever been before after orbiting the moon for 24 hours taking round the 24 hours Armstrong and Aldrin moved to the lunar module lunar there, there is one type of a path module known as the eagle that is called the eagle so the name of the eagle that why we have give, they have given the name the eagle has landed that space that their vehicle that okay known as eagle colin stayed in the columbia the eagle separated from the columbia and landed on the moon on 28th july see 16 17 18 19 20 how much far it is you know how much far it is if you see that millions and millions kilometer away but the, the spaceship you know the speed of that space is very high so within this five days they could reach and one by one part they keep aside and they landed on 20th July 1969 at 4.17 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, the lunar module landed on the moon's Sea of Tranquility. Sea of a Tranquility, where it is landed, the place where they landed, that is a Sea of a Tranquility in Keller, a place in the California, that is okay now. And uh, Armstrong radioed. Mission control, Houston Tranquility, based here, the legal has uh, landed. The mission, which for what purpose they went, they, he said that he, we are landed there. Unbelievable. People from all over the world were glued, attached. Glued means attached. Everybody knows that 16th of July 1969, the airspace spacecraft and the few scientists, Neil Armstrong along with him, went away. And when they heard that, it was in, unbelievable that okay, really they reached there because they're the first time ever in the life, the first time the human being stepped in that on that moon so everybody all the people of um, us and all the us they were there near television they were seeing watching what happened it's unbelievable uh, thing 
people from all over the world were glued to their te television screens. Nearly seven hours later, at 10.56, 15 seconds, 10 hours, 56 minutes and 15 minutes, EDN. What is mean by ED? The EDT, Eastern Daylight Time. That is EDT time. Okay. Neil Armstrong took mankind's first step on the surface on the moon. All four went, three, four went. But you know, coming out from that space and, and landing first on the moon was the first personality was Neil Armstrong. That was really great history. Okay. The mission was almost about to fail before landing. That is, of course, completely science. It was about to fail, but by the grace of God, they could reach there and landing. In fact, the lunar model flashed a yellow caution light 6,000 feet above the lunar surface before it landed. Armstrong advised both Collins and Houston in the command model because they were touched in. Uh, downside also okay with their office mate with their other scientists what was a 2 12 1 2 2 that is 12 not 2 it mean that the computer had too many things that is one type of you know um, their we can say uh, program code, code word, that is 1202, that was their code to talk with each other and what is that. So what was that 1202? It means that the computer had too many things to do at once. Should they abort the lunar landing? Means as it was written, it was near about to fail it's supposed to fail and they were thinking we will quit this we will not reach we will not go up to moon we will go back that much problem had created but they could manage and they could reach there okay about about miss quit because it was their problem was there fight controller for the lunar modules computer activity determined that everything was fine later when the apollo 11 crew received medals of freedom steve bells received one two without his fast and accurate what is mean accurate correct correct input the lunar landing would not have taken place on 20th july 1969 at 10 56 pm that is eastern daylight time neil armstrong placed his first left boat on the surface on the moon and said that's one small step his when he stood uh, kept his first step then he said that's one small step for a man one giant leap for mankind then he answered the question that scientists and laymen alike had asked for centuries what is the moon like then when they reached successfully reached many scientists and many people asked them Ki how it looks how it is means many 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 questions are there is it like our earth is it there how is the uh, soil there how is the rocks there you know love like earth only moon is there there is a soil there is a rock there is a only one there we cannot go there because there is no water and no air as there is no water so there is no air also no plant so no food so we cannot go and stay there so all these scientists they carried their oxygen for these many days and they stayed there understand okay moon like the surface is fine and powdery these people are saying the surface you know the earth is surface is very powdery and uh, fine armstrong reported i can pick up loose within my toe i cannot toe means with my fingers and toe i can pick up my loose this one means like earth only that all everybody was you know surprised ki how it is they want to listen from them how that moon is like that okay so there seems to be no difficulty in moving around as we suspected means moving there when we go there it is not difficult to go anywhere we can move very easily everywhere 18 minutes later aldrin 
join Armstrong after 18 minutes. First Neil Armstrong, then after 18 minutes, who went in there? That is uh, Aldrin. Aldrin, the another scientist who went along with uh, him, Neil Armstrong. Aldrin joined Armstrong on the lunar surface. Aldrin also walked on the moon during that first trip while Michael Collins remaining with Columbia means that spacecraft, okay, Columbia orbited the moon 30 times. During their 2 hours and 31 minutes of uh, transversing, what is mean transversing, moving or traveling through area, that moon area, means transversing the moon, 2 hours, 31 minutes they have taken round the moon. Aldrin and Armstrong also took pictures of the lunar landscape and of each others so they have taken photographs also each others and whatever they have seen there that photographs also they have taken they planted an, an american flag and left a plague so first time the first time these people went so they carried the their flag american flag and that is a very proud moment they kept their flag on the top of the on the moon and there they have written plaque plaque means a piece of flat metal with writing on it place of a uh, place means here after all so those who will go to reach moon and if they see if they can understand yes first personality they have reached here on the 16th of july 1969 and all the neil armstrong the aldrin and uh, michael and everything they have kept and there they put the flag American flag, very proud moment for them. Here men from planet earth first set foot upon the moon, July 1969 AD. Thousands and thousand years or so, if you know, we don't know after 100 years what will happen. We don't know after 500 uh, years of what will happen this scientist may progress and after few years the men will also go and stay there at that time they will also come to know in the 1969 AD few people from America they had come and they have landed here that was the first time so for that our Indian flag is also there 1984 when the Rakesh Sharma went he said that time uh, Mrs. Indira Gandhi was the Prime Minister, First Lady Prime Minister of uh, India. So when he went there, he said the Indira Gandhi Pushriti, apna bhara, apna uh, land, apni prutvi kaisi dikti upase, to Rakesh Sharma said that clip I have seen in the TV that apna bhi pura world pura nila nila dikta hai, bohot acha lagta hai. So he Rakesh Sharma said and when he went that the fourth, that is a, India has a fourth nation. Again, that our India is a fourth nation, he went top and he also kept our Indian flag there on the moon in 1984. After 21.6 hours of total time of the moon, Armstrong and Aldrin safely left the surface in the lunar model and docked cut off then they left there only these two people went another where was in the spacecraft only okay in the columbia with columbia of their return to earth again they have come here and they reached here uh, to set down how many hours they were there 21.6 hours of total time on the moon 21 near about not completely one day but equally to come one day 24 hours in a day so this 21.6 these many hours they were there and they left they sat in the Columbia to return back to a country in the world so this is they have given the legal the eagle has landed they have kept the name that so very fantastic and especially those who are interested in science and all they like this very much so dear children read this lesson once again very carefully and try to understand and again you want the deep knowledge about the space and all other thing go to google and go to net and surf about this i hope you understood this lesson very carefully uh, understood lesson Read the lesson once again and try to understand the lesson.
Thank you and have a nice day.